Hey everybody, welcome back to another video. Welcome back to another. <laughs> I haven't filmed this one in a long time, Sha, and I'm thinking to myself, woo wee, the day I do. Get up right now. Harit. Wait, Harit. Welcome back, everybody. Welcome back to another video. Thank you, thank you so much for choosing me over and over again. I really do appreciate you. I appreciate you coming here, watching the video, liking the video, also subscribing to the channel. It means so, so much to me. It does so, so much for me. I really do appreciate it. Uh, let's get into the video, okay? We're going to do a candid with cat, okay? And the day I put this up on my Instagram, I think it was like, uh, I don't know. I think it was like, uh, what's that now? Sure. I think it was two weeks ago where I was like, tell me the most annoying thing about the opposite sex. And what a wow. <laughs> I could have caught all of you outside because Honole, Honole, you know, because I went through them and they were still coming in and I was just like, yo, 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 the girlies and the boysies are mad because this time around we got some comments from guys as well. And I was just like, which one? Why? <laughs> which one is this one? So we're going to have a chat. I'm going to have my drink because this is where I'm at now. I don't, I don't, I don't sugar the gins anymore because tonic water, I'm just, just easy, easy whisk. Let's get into the video, okay? Tell me what are your most annoying things about the opposite sex. And wow, what a wow was there a lot, okay? We're, 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 literally, gonna, we're literally gonna get into it. Let's get into the video. The first lady is just done. She's just done with men, okay? She's just done with men. She says everything. Inconsistent, dishonest, not being compelled. Oh, I like it. Now you tell Bazani again, sis, that the way is. Not being compassionate, nonchalant. Let me tell you. Inconsistent, siavum. Dishonest, siavum. Not being compassionate. Hey, 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 hey. <laughs> Which one? I mean, I mean, some of them are. I mean, I guess, but I'm standing with the girlies. So yes, yes, sister, yes. Right. The next lady says, talking too much about themselves and their co- Yo, 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 yo. I can go to IT. I can go to IT. Yeah, one more. Cheers. Cheers. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm. Talking too much about themselves and their accomplishments. Like, sir, I know that you live at home and you wear mismatched socks. Okay. <laughs> so please don't come at you know what for me it's one of the most annoying things and not only does it annoy me it turns me off if you're gonna sit here and tell me about how much money you make or how much this cost or how much whatever and and how you've achieved this and you were in conferences with the president and then you sat and you did this and then you went to this conference because not everybody was invited to the conference because only the elite oh, i don't care damn the free access that so he's a freak at just at just at just I don't care them. I really don't. I don't care if you know Euphonic. I don't care if you know DJ Fresh. Okay? I don't care if you and Babe Zotumo were sitting somewhere and having a chat about life and stress. And I don't care. I really don't care. What? Okay. Yeah? What is it that you want to come out of you telling me that information what must happen must i become a groupie for you and be like oh my God. what are you serious you met them what do they do and what is what do you do get out of here jesus men and leaving their ish on the floor my OCD, yo, mudimu, ke wena socks, ke wena keys, ke wena underwear, wena plate, wena pencil, pen, wena teki, wena, yay, I know that one. Mm. 
Oh, I'm so tired, child. I would, I'm so tired. I'm so tired. I'm really tired. She fell and Jesus goes on. And a lot of the time, some of those things sometimes are not even washed. When I walk out. That Kausi has been sitting there for the last three weeks. Kausi. Kausi ibu dila. Inga. Kuri. Wana senda. Woo! And then they leave them there. Casual. No problem. See a plate. He forgot that he put a plate underneath the coffee table and that one. And it been sitting there. It been sitting there. It's collected all the dust and the pee and the grass and the everything. It's just sitting there. It's just sitting there. When I have feel like, you know when a plate has been sitting somewhere for over a week and you try and wash it. Do you know how stressful that process is? <laughs> I can go I can go Utanka was kirpoti wa bona. You are here. You are here. Plate. Ene nal nam. Ah. Orubule watrop. Orubule watrop. And just see it. See it all. Yabara watrop. Ha ha. You want to know the type of person you are with? Open their wardrobe. Open their wardrobe. One good. Ah. Nake khatet. I'm just tired. There's sometimes, you know, sometimes things, they don't have to be that neat. You're born all right. Just folded it up and whatever. But it's folded. If someone just... Why? When they pick us like fruit at a party and we're desperately waiting on them to say something. When they think that we get pretty and dress up for them like Pharrell now. I absolutely agree. I absolutely like Rona Halle Repika Ridi Apoli. Aye, 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 aye. When you're picking at us, so Rimada is a run. Ridi Tokoman. I'll have the one in the red dress. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Where? 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 Catch me. Catch me. Where? Because. Me dressing up the way I'm dressing up, the way I am looking. I'm doing it for myself before I'm doing it for anybody else. And then you come to a party because when na you see it's going. When you hot, you are dressed nice, you can say the Fabiani, you can say the, 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 the Botticelli, you can say the Tom Ford, you can say the whatever. When you are the score away. I get When you are the score away, you will pick the fruit like you are picking apples. Or you're picking grapes because you're going to sour them and make wine for... Ta! How about that? How about catch me outside? I am not some sort of commodity or some sort of thing that you can just pick. fruit. No, 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 no. And they do that. No, they listen to. They give solutions when we're trying just to vent and become unnecessarily dramatic. Mara, why? Ooh, this one is personal. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Oh, this one is it's personal. They give solutions. Me, I don't mind the person who gives solutions. Give me the solutions, but then help me with those solutions. Otherwise, if you're just going to listen and drop hints, Tula. Tula Bova, Briga Bova, I don't want to hear it. I'll figure it out. If I'm coming to you and I'm talking to you about I'm going through a situation like this, I'm going through a financial bind like this, I'm going through, I'm fighting with my sister and this and this is happening and I'm trying to get things right and you're going to come at me with solutions, you better do something more than just say a solution. If I say that my tires are going in the next two months and it's changed my tires, I'm, I'm expecting you to say, okay, are you going to be sharp there or uh, do you have so something yan or nukwalise or whatever? Don't come at me dropping hints like, mm, I don't know what you're going to do. I don't, what, what are you going to do? Yo, matara yo, yo, yo. That's tricky. What are you going to do? How about I'm going to walk up out of this house? 
Jeez. No, man. Get out of here. Get out of here. <coughs> they lie. What's in here? What? It's new. They lie like it's coming out of their ears, nose, bum. But it's coming out of their pee pee holes. They lie like it's just... Yo, 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 yo. You know some people, when we lie, we feel bad. Even if it's like a, a small and a little white lie or something. Man, we feel bad. Like there's this thing that comes over you where you're just like, yo, 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 wait. That wasn't necessary. I think I think you went too far there. Mara, these ones, they will lie and tell you I was not there. What? Meanwhile, I saw you on Conquer Live on a lady show. I saw you on Conquer Live and you were sitting with that girl and you were popping ace of spades. Meanwhile, me na untangeli penini. I penini. And when I try to, 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 to show you, you're telling me who talks to you, You're telling me life jives to my face that that's not me. And every time I think about all the lies that have been dished my way because of a man. Yes, sis. Woo! Sis. I hate it when a man asks you to visit him shortly after you guys have met or be saying, Sifebanani. <laughs> <I'm sorry. laughs> I didn't read that. I was just reading it. Oh. Guy, what kind of man you mean? God, okay. I hate when a man asks you to visit him shortly after you've met or be saying things like Sifeba Nanini. I feel like the word is disrespectful. Of course it is. I mean, uh, I mean, I mean, I mean. Of course it is. It's like Mutako just a straight to Rejanani. That's in my language is Rejanani. What? Hey, you're dirty. Wash out your mouth with a saber, man. Wash out your mouth with soap. Wash out your mouth with Detol, Desdomesto, see, Handy, Handy. I don't care. I don't care, damn, what you wash your mouth out with. But what is this Sifebananini? What is this Rejanani? Where are you meeting these people? Woo! You can't go to the house. You can't go to the house. You can't go to you meet people who speak like this? I'm sorry. Hey! perhaps. That time maybe you underpin that thing. You're not that very one who's saying who's the feminine. Maybe that time you end up where he's got holes all over it. Who be his mother? Who's his feminine? Who am I, daughter? I can't. Who grow the pinky nail? Why? You know what? I asked my cousin. I asked my cousin, and I was think. I think. I think. I think. I mean. Uh, I mean. I mean. I mean. I was probably like seventeen, eighteen. I asked my cousin. I'm like, bro. Tell me, why do your mates, okay, why do some of your mates grow this nail? Why are they growing, why are they growing this nail? Why? Why are they growing that nail? Please explain to me why are they growing that nail. And then he'll be like, no, I can't tell you, I can't tell you. Are you growing that nail so that you can pick at your nose and go far up in there? Because now you can't if you don't have a, 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 a long nail, right? So is it because you can pick up a nose and you can dig for gold and then eat it? <laughs> sorry, I'm not sorry. <laughs> and then I found out at a later stage in my life that a lot of the guys who've got long nails like that often, uh, oh, I thought my phone rang, often smoke weed. Okay, so basefa. Yeah, understand. Basefa. What's up, Matekwani Pela? You know, with the weed you like, and then ba, yeah, one, and then basefa, basefa. They take out the, the pits and the. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> I don't know because guys are naturally dirty, okay? <laughs> okay, not all of them. You hear my chat. 
but a lot of them are. Could you imagine all the mohodu and dust and grass and budila that collect under that nail? And then he's gonna... Now this is by a man. And he says, that women think we should pay them for dating, then forgetting that it takes two to tangle. Mm. I think you got the wrong one with this one, good sir. And I know this guy. <laughs> the why, what, how, oh, I say leave them for God. I think you got the wrong one. I mean, when we are dating, and you chose to date Tarisha, me. You chose, Uti, Mkalubu date Tarisha. Can I date Tarisha you? Can I take you on a date Tarish? Yeah, understand? And now, if you're going to take me on a date Tarish, what must to can happen? Because you're going to be Caesar. Be Caesar, be Caesar, be Caesar, be Caesar, be Caesar. That's what you have. What must you do to can happen when you take me on the date Tarish? Because, because according to me, if you are taking me out on the day, Tarish, you have to handle the bill. What is this two must tango? It takes two to tango. Of course, but not in the dating phase. Why? 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 Why is two tango Risha ring? You are the one who needs to tango Risha for me. Because you are the one who asked me on the date. Right? Excuse me. You asked me to come with you to this here restaurant, McDonald. Call whatever, wherever we are. You're the one who asked me. My smaga. I bad. Him foot. Um, No, no, no. I said it's wrong. The one who asked the other one on a date. Whether you ask me today, and then you ask me tomorrow, and then you ask me Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, and we see each other seven days in a row. If you are asking me on the date. Guess who's liable to pay? The only time I can understand the two to tango is when we are in a relationship fully fledged. We have decided that we want to be together, want to do whatever. Then that's a completely different conversation. But um, data, you're still trying to get to know me. You're still trying to get in my pants because we know for a fact that you're taking me out on this date because you find me physically attractive and you are hoping that by the end of this evening or the end of this week, or two weeks from now, that you and I are gonna smash, smash and smash. I understand. So, but also your favorite, your favorite, whichever one you want to call it. I don't know, whichever one you want to call it. They grow too slow. A guy can be in his 30s and still think like a 19 year old, preach the gospel. Hey, and a babangat. There's too many to count. 30 years old and you're still thinking about, hey, I want to go here, go there, party here, party there. No sense of urgency about saving your money. No sense of urgency about making a good life for yourself. When I'm jail, you got the money you want to spend, you want to drink. You don't mind whether you end up in jail. You don't mind whether you end up half passed out on the street in jail. You don't care. You don't think about long term. That time you're 37 years old. You don't think about long term, you're just thinking about how am I going to get to Saturday night? How am I going to get a drink? Way. And you start thinking about who are you going to ask for a money? Because when you don't have a money. Uh, I'm just tired. That time? When did you get paid? Last week. This week? Daughter. 19. 19-year-old. 19 Pelly, Pelly. Pelly, they think that they are our God on earth. Do they? Really? That's mistaken. Mm -mm. No ma'am. <laughs> no ma'am. Far from it. They gaslight women's opinions. Absolutely. Yo, 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 yo. Wait, well, men can gaslight and make you feel like you're going crazy. And it's worse when you're dealing with someone who is professional. A professional narc. Do you understand? A professional narcissist who's going to... Bona, they're gonna dribble, they're gonna dribble your mind, and you're going to be sitting there thinking, What? No, but I didn't mean it in that way. No, but why are you doing that? No, yeah, so you did this, so you know how it makes me feel when you do this. this. I mean, I, but wait, no, 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 no,
Narcissists are number one with gaslighting and they're so good at it that you can't tell them nothing. You can't tell them and nothing. So therefore, narcissists can catch me like two streets away. No. Using the last bit of sugar in the sugar pot and then they don't refill it. I'm sorry. I feel like this is a personal vendetta. This here lady is mad at somebody. I mean, that's not nice. And I don't think all of them do that, though. Do they? <laughs> oh, Lord. Men are so basic, and that alone bores me. Very rare to find a man with a good EQ. Maybe I need to do better, but it's very rare to find a man with a good EQ. That's absolutely true. That's absolutely true. I couldn't agree with you more. It is so rare to find a guy with a good EQ. And it's just like, I mean, I guess so sharp. I mean, I mean, I guess. But that time you're bored stiff. You're bored out of your mind. Your fights are not fair. They're not mature. Umuntu is going to be emotionally unavailable, emotionally distant. They're going to gaslight you. They're going to manipulate you. All in the sense that they want to win the fight. I could EQ. I could EQ. It's gone. I could EQ Shem. When that is the case, the EQ shit's gone. Shit's very much gone. Um, lying without reason. What's new? Is the sun shining outside? Correct. That's what they do. Yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. Men, how they are self-centered. Like, after sexy time, they pass out. Nako, ew, I'm not even done. That is so true! I can go Selfish, 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 selfish. Could you imagine? They get on top of you while hemela. Yiba, 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 yiba. Then they are happy. Yiba, yiba, yiba. Sir, where? Why? why? Which one? <laughs> I know that one. And I think a lot of women can attest to that one. Hore way. The party had so kale lo kale o so robetse. And at that I find extreme. <clears throat> I find that extremely selfish. Mar jolang anyway. It's actually Zishin Ilie. Jolang because you choose to stay with them people. Lava le selfish jual when they don't even care them. Whether you are mad at the fact that they're sleeping or not, they are sleeping. They don't care. Manataba. Okay. That kind of nigga can catch me outside. So um, <laughs> selective listening. You say something, now they've either forgotten or they weren't listening. Absolutely. Not even you say something and they've either forgotten or they weren't listening. Sure, but can you imagine selective listening in a fight? So now they hear the fact that you said, I'm mad about the fact that you did ABC. I felt like it was selfish of you. Oh! Oh, so now I'm selfish. They don't understand what you said before you said I felt like it was selfish of you. I didn't like it that you did this, this. Oh, so now I'm selfish. Oh, wow. I wasn't selfish when I bought you those shoes. I wasn't selfish when I was taking you out to that restaurant. Now I'm selfish? Wow. Yo, I got you. You're hurtful, Shem. Yo, you're hurtful. Bruv. <sighs> this is all I got. Stop gaslighting me. Firstly, stop that. Listen to what I've just said, sir, ma'am. Okay, this is what I've just said. Stop gaslighting me. And then they do it. And then they do it. The male gender pees everywhere. Oh my god. <laughs> no way. No way my drink is looking like a bit of pee chat. <laughs> It's a whiskey. It's a whiskey. It's a whiskey. <sighs> the male gender pees everywhere. They don't even try to be discreet. Oh my god. They do, don't they? Could you imagine? Like on a morning you're driving to work, you're on the freeway, and then you see a car pulled over on the yellow lane, and a gent comes out and he pees. And just pees. And he just points his, and you know how they always hold their member? They always hold their member like, so they'll hold the member, and then they'll hold the hand like that. And they pee everywhere. Why? Why? Which one is that one? Which one is that one? Why are you peeing everywhere? Why are you peeing on the streets? Why? How can we swatter? 
and then now you just came onto the freeway. Usile garage, two minutes away. Usile garage. You couldn't tell a minute ago that you needed to go pee. <clears throat> when they want to be begged, you'll spend hours doing it and they will never beg for shit. Absolutely true. Absolutely true. I'm not even gonna lie. Th this, that is the absolute truth. They will not beg for anything. Do you understand? Nothing. They'll never beg. They'll be like, uh-uh, uh-uh. Meanwhile, me now, now I've hurt your feelings and now I'm saying sorry. I'm sorry. Please forgive me. I'm sorry. I understand. I will say sorry for two days. Two days. When uh, them, on the other hand, when they're saying sorry to you for what they've done to you, they'll be like, I'm oh, sorry, Ganti. Hey, now I'm sorry. 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 I'm Meanwhile, when when he's angry at you, you will be saying sorry from here to Timba two, three days, three days, five minutes and two seconds. You will be saying sorry until they see f to finish that. Okay, I feel alright now. The double standards, yeah. So you can do it, but I can't. Mm. Okay, you can go and have a good time with your friends and come back at two o'clock in the morning, three o'clock in the morning. But now if I step in at 12.01 a.m., it's like, wow. So you finally decided to come home. Hey, Bob! Hey, Bob! Which one? Hey, Ladies don't behave like that. I'm sorry? Are you a lady? How would you know? Yeah. How ladies behave. <laughs> They're like that. That was... <laughs> I'm so tired. I'm so done with me, bro. <laughs> I'm gonna go. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please like the video. Thumbs up it. Subscribe. Join the family. I also do have a membership space where I do do these kinds of videos as well. As well as very personal videos. So if you'd like to join the membership space, do that. And lastly, thank you. Thank you for choosing me over and over again. I really do appreciate you being here and I appreciate the support that you give me. Until the next one, I'll see you very, very soon. Mwah. Bye.